r slash ask reddit adults of reddit what is something you should have mastered by now but failed to do so writing a consistent signature idk i just write my name like a four yo mine is just a bunch of scribbled lines i never have the same signature twice mine is just my name printed with a big swoosh at the end so it looks like i know what i'm doing but i really don't Every time I bite my tongue or the inside of my cheek, I am reminded how I still have not mastered chewing after decades of chewing daily. If it makes you feel better, you have chewed things hundreds upon hundreds of times this week alone. A bite of steak might be a dozen or more chews and you'll take many bites of it. Think not about how you haven't yet mastered chewing, but how your chewing failure rate is like one failure per several thousand operations, which isn't bad. Keeping my bedroom clean. Always thought as a kid that it just magically happened for adults. It doesn't. You still have to clean your bedroom even when you are 33. And cleaning in general. My house is a mess and I feel like it's an uphill battle. It's not gross. But nowhere near my mom's standards. Accepting a compliment. I'm giving an awkward response 10 out of 10 times. This one's easy. Always. Always say thanks. In a cheery tone. Just use that and don't bring any more attention to it. And avoid responding with a self-deprecating comment every time. After a while, it tends to make people worry. I can't tie a balloon once I've inflated it. I can't inflate a balloon. Planning meals eating healthy. Date marry a food conscious person. They help tremendously. Bonus. They will make up with you sometimes. Sleeping. Terrible at falling asleep. Good at sleeping though. Trying to fall asleep is sometimes like trying to start a lawnmower that won't start no matter how many times you pull the cord. Going to bed and getting up at the same time every day in a consistent routine. On the flip side of this, I can rarely sleep in past 7.38 on the weekends anymore. I'm 36, still have no problem sleeping till noon. However it isn't uncommon for me to sleep straight through my alarm when I should be getting up for work. But luckily, I'm not hourly and as long as I make money my bosses don't care. Handwriting. It has gotten worse not better. Peaked at 4th grade. Same. I've had several different styles too. Nothing looks good. I hope I'm never involved in a crime where handwriting analysis comes into play because who oh boy that analyst is going to be annoyed. Did you write this in 2008? Uh, maybe? Yeah I can't read it either. My boyfriend hates my grocery lists. I tend to write in clouds instead of columns and I'm lazy about picking up my pen. So it's a half cursive unintelligible scribble most of the time. He said he's learned to recognize the shape of my words rather than the letters. I try to at least stick to columns to make it easier. 36 year old. Can't whistle. I can't whistle outwards like a normal person. My only option is to suck air in. Not letting stupid people's opinions bother me. I get so many ignorant comments that I don't engage with because I think they are a waste of time. But I think about them anyway. Forever. Dealing with people. In general. I've gotten so much worse as I've gotten older. In high school I love meeting new people. In my 30s. It terrifies me. My taxes. I'm 32 and my wife still insists on doing them. Even if I did do them. She would redo them to make sure it was perfect. Don't worry I'm sure she's not using you to launder money unwittingly. I'm sure there is no chance of tax evasion charges or anything silly like that. She's a smart lady. She would know how to pull it off. Hell. Ever since she started making more money than me I just backed off on all the finances and we were both happy. Win win. Getting out of bed on the first alarm. I had to move the alarm to where I had to get up to turn it off otherwise I would hit snooze 20 times and be late for work. Housekeeping. I love having a clean house but I'm bad at keeping it entirely clean all the time. I need to get some sort of system going but I get overwhelmed with all the shit we have that I'm like WTF do I even do with this? Last week I straight up got sick of having stuff I wasn't using, wasn't worth selling, and didn't want to pack away again. So I threw it the duck out. I'm considering getting some booze after work today and going for round 2. It's impossible to clean around stacks of things you don't even really want. Talking with the opposite sex. It used to be a disaster 90% of the time. Now it's 
so I'm still nowhere near close to mastering it. I'll either behave like a normal person or like a caricature of myself. Nothing in between. Also I haven't mastered basic multitasking, like driving and talking on the phone or with my passengers. For example, my brain just freezes and defaults to the most important activity, driving, while making sure to nod on occasion to seem like I'm paying attention to the noise. Playing my guitar, I guess. It has been sitting in my room for almost a decade yet I haven't even learned how to strum some basic tunes. An impulse by that had me fascinated for about 48 hours before I gave up. It still looks cool in my room, though. Dude 3 chords and you can make money, or get laid, or tell awesome stories. Seriously, just 3 chords. Go, learn M, G, C, and D, edit, yo, OP. This got some traction. I hope you're out there learning some chords cause you got a plethora of online friends willing to help you out. Here are a few easy as balls songs you can learn that only have 3 or 4 simple chords. Wagon Wheel by Old Crow Medicine Show LA Freeway by Guy Clark Blowing in the Wind by Bob Dylan. If you all got any other suggestions, add them to the list. Folding fitted sheets. I make my wife do it. Actually let me rephrase that. I piss and moan about how hard it is until my wife comes in the room to make fun of me for being pathetic before taking it upon herself to do it for me. Tying a tie. Came here to say this. I'm 43 years old and I still have to google youtube it. Probably because I only have to wear a tie maybe twice a year. But still. Feeling comfortable in social situations. Saran wrap. I just cannot get that beach to work right. Saran wrap is the biggest inside joke of capitalism ever. Make a product that everyone wants, nobody can use, and everyone will continue to buy. Genius. Cooking rice. Laundry. I mean, I can put stuff in the machine and add soap and press a button. But there are so many other ways to remove stains and sort delicates and iron shirts and extra buttons that do whatever. And I don't understand it. My in-laws can bleach stuff. I have no idea how to use bleach without destroying everything in sight. Press start and the machine goes. That's what I know. Same. Whites. Colors. Towels. Throw em all in with a couple tasty looking Tide Pods and hit that regular load cycle. I hang dry the shirts I care about and that's it. So far so good at 26. Parallel parking. 40 in January. Driving a motor vehicle. Although I couldn't drive because of my disability it should have been something that I mastered enough to get my license 20 years ago. There's reasons why I haven't. Friends vehicular deaths. Followed by an accident on my last test before getting my probationary license that put me into the hospital. But really, I just have no valid excuses. I understand the freedom and independence that you get when you have a license too. Whoa, you made it to the end? You're a ducking beast. I'll cut you a deal. Smash like and subscribe for more curated content bruh. It's free and that's a great price.